It's a home that's gotten a lot of attention since it was put on the market in December. Probably because it's not just a home, it's also an island. You're not too many houses are built on a coral reef. I don't think you can do that. <laughs> Robert Williford bought the one and a half acre property in the Florida Keys 20 years ago. He lives in Coral Gables full time and when he isn't using it as a vacation home, he rents it out along with the boat for $5,000 a week. In 1992, it cost Williford $1 million. Today, it'll cost you $12 million, and realtor Marvin Arrieta says people from all over the world are showing interest. It's really unique property, you know. Have a helipad, you can have your own helicopter, and um, it's not all island of that, all, all together, green location, etc., etc. Adding to its uniqueness, something Williford did himself, making the entire home solar and wind powered. We don't need any any support from, you know, from from the utilities. We get all of our water from the rain. This is the airport, and our island is right here. Arietta says that out of 1,700 islands that make up the Keys, a fraction are like this one. Just nine islands have a uh, just one house, so it's really unique if somebody want to real privacy there. The three bedroom, two bathroom home comes with a guest house and two boat docks, not to mention a full view of the Atlantic.